morning and Happy New Year. It's a Japanese tradition, uh, New Year. Um, in England and America, it's a, Jap it's a tradition to go out and get really drunk and kind of celebrate the midnight. Um, in Japan, uh, the tradition is more to get up in the morning and, or stay up all night, of course, and come see the first sunrise of the new year. Um, so that's what I've done. This is a kind of lookout point. Uh, pretty near my house, actually, I cycled up here. Uh, it's right near Perry's Rock, uh, which is when the first Westerners came to Okinawa in the late 18th century. Uh, it's actually the rock over there. And um, planted a flag as they made their way north. Uh, and you can actually see that rock from my, the roof of my house. Um, so, uh, it's New Year's. Probably a good time to uh, make New Year's resolutions. <laughs> and I think 2018 is going to have to be the year I actually do some self-employment. Uh, I really have been thinking about this for years. Um, obviously, there's a, a, a play space, stroke school. I don't want to call it a school um, thing. Education project. Uh, and obviously that's already started, um, but I need to get out there, promote it, tell people what I'm doing, and invite them to come join me. Um, also, there's um, some workshops I'd like to teach, um, some classes, maybe regular classes I'd like to run, um, just kind of sharing my um, the things I've learned um, in a way that people will hopefully find it easy to learn from and um, there's a couple of real sticking points I think I have around this <laughs> one is um, just doing having confidence in doing what I you know want to do and that people will find it interesting um, I kind of need to get over that obviously lots of people may not find it interesting and that's fine but some people will find it interesting and I should probably try to make it available for them um, asking people for money is another sticking point. I find that really difficult. Um, that's definitely something to work on. Obviously, I, I mean, I, I'd love to give everything away for free. Really, I would. Um, but obviously, I do have bills to pay, children to feed. Um, if I'm putting a lot of time and effort into things, it kind of seems reasonable that I should charge money for it. Um, so we're kind of, um, that's a sticking point. That's a big sticking point for me, actually. I find that difficult. Um, so I'm going to work on that. And uh, the other thing I'm going to try and work on is um, sharing a little bit more of the process. Um, I quite like making these YouTube videos. Again, I don't know how many people find them interesting, but perhaps somebody will. And uh, I'm going to try and share a little more of the process of my, really, my learning processes, <laughs> my learning experiences. Um, just put them out there online and then maybe some other people, like I say, I'm sure lots of people won't find it interesting at all, but maybe there are some people that will find it interesting and have something to learn from it, and I'll try and share it uh, for them. Uh, especially try and share the, the bits where it's getting a little bit more difficult for me, um, because I think that's probably where the real learning is. It's tempting to only share the good bits and the fun bits and the bits where I'm feeling positive. Um, but I think it probably is worthwhile trying to share the negative bits where I'm not feeling so good and where it's getting difficult and I'm getting bogged down um, because then people can hopefully I'll, I'll surmount those obstacles and people will perhaps see how and learn a little bit perhaps learn from that anyway this one's getting long I try to keep these videos as short as possible so happy new year everybody and uh, that's it happy new year everybody <laughs> goodbye <laughs>